Hey guys, welcome to Addicted to Game Salad. So today's episode is all about the navigation menu. It's quick, it's simple, and it's easy. It will take about two minutes, hopefully less. But to get you started, what we've done is I've made a template. Just something simple, nothing with any high graphics, as you can see. What we've got is just a basic, here's where your title will be and your, me your menu. So what we've got is your play, your settings, so you can change your volume and your music and your screen size and all your game controllers and your how to play, so your instructions and all that kind of stuff if you are planning on having that in your game. So just open up your game salad, click on a blank new project, you can keep the name the same, you can change it to whatever you want. Add three new scenes, one for each of those, but we'll be updating this later to make it a lot cooler and hopefully only have it on two scenes. But for this one, we want a main menu, we want a play or a level select, it's up to you. And for the next one, settings and a how to play or an instructions tab. So first just go into main menu and we want to drag this out a bit, we want to grab our little folder, little file, you can just drag it straight in there, it will pop up. It's just a background, it's nothing fancy, it's a lot easier than making tons of different actors, it's just a simple way of doing it. But what you want to do is you might want to make another actor and call this one a the button and what you want to do is go into the button create a new rule when touch is pressed change scene down the bottom here pull up and leave it like that that is it that's all the code you have to do for that one and what you oh sorry i keep forgetting this but you want to change the opacity to zero once it's done scroll back drag it out on top of this fold it down so it's same size as the play button, it can be over just because some people's fingers are a bit big. Unlock it, change it to play, and do the so on, so on for each one of them. You can just use the top one, or you can just control, copy, paste. So it's just, or alt, sorry, keep forgetting that it's on a Mac. And then just click back onto it, unlock it, change that to settings, go back, unlock how to play. And once that's done, you can play it and have a quick look. So it takes you to the play scene. And then on the play scene, you could have your level select or you could jump straight in, tap to start game. And then if you go back to the main page, hit settings, it takes you to the settings page. Go back, hit how to play, and it takes you to a how to play page. So guys, that's just a quick, simple, easy way for you beginners out there that have no clue how to start your own menu. That's one way to get it done. There's a lot more and we'll be showing you in future updates of videos. Thanks for watching.